Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Thief. Last time we took care of the carnal connoisseur, which is very disappointing because I could not solve a way to get everything without at least one suspicion. But what's done is done. Can always replay it if somebody else is able to find a way to take care of that business. In the meantime, we have arrived at Chapter 5, which I've heard is the resident scary mission. I'm a little skeptical that they're retreading the asylum. I feel like we already did that in Thief 3, but maybe they'll surprise me. I am, of course, in the dark, in the basement. It's the middle of the night, and I'm wearing my headset at full volume, so... Let's go reach the asylum grounds. I think I read this last time, but refresher won't hurt. Somewhere deep in the shadows of Moira Asylum lie the answers. Many things can be stolen, but the truth needs to be found. In the visions, it seems that Erin wants to say something, but her message is always strange and abstract. One thing is clear, though. Erin and the asylum are connected somehow, and the clues are there to be discovered. We are at Moira Asylum Path. Warning, beware escapees. Fair enough. Asylum Grounds. New objective, enter the asylum. Well, alright. Let's get after it. Edwina Moira, hers was the dream the Baron brought to life. BRY459. I'm wondering if that's the widow Moira from Thief 3. That would be interesting. The BRY459, 400 years ago timeline seems right. Over here we have a hand mirror. That's one. I I forgot to even check this. One of 106 pieces of loot, including six collectibles. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, and look, a plaque. Speaking of collectibles, a fine piece. Moira Asylum, 13 of 16 city heritage plaques. Hers was the dream the Baron brought to life, founded BRY 459. Yeah, the timeline makes sense for that to be the Widow Moira. That'd be kinda cool.
Definitely interesting noises happening. Chess piece, two and three of 106. And a new throwable. for me at least. We got a hairbrush here. Four of 106. Looks like the front door has opened. This was not here before. Ancient Vessel, 5 of 106. Hmm. Okay. Seems someone's expecting me. stuck in here now. You shouldn't be here. Is it the asylum that's haunted me? startled, especially when that picture of the eyeball looking through the keyhole blinked just then. Aaron was here, and the female ward is probably a good start. New objective. Find information about Aaron. Activity Log, one of 42 Chapter 5 documents, 517 NRY 842, no visitors today, 518 NRY 842, no visitors today, 519 NRY 842, patient number 63 received Lord Abercrombie, 520 NRY 842, no visitors today. 521 NRY 842, patient number 18 received her patron. 522 NRY 842, no visit, and we're cut off. All right. 99 of 215 documents. Never stop loot hunting. I have a pocket portrait, 6 of 106. Pen, 7 of 106. anything else except to head to the whoa where the hell did those boards come from except to head to the second floor alright you know what I'm a little unnerved this is working for me
curtain. Make sure there's nothing on this staircase. See anything else up here? Just another cabinet and desk. Ink bottle, eight of one hundred six. Scissors, 9 of 106. And now we need to pick a lock. Document. Patient admitted. That's 2 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. 623 NRY841. Received patient number 18, young female, admitted by the state and delivered under guard. Condition moderate to poor, numerous abrasions and broken bones. Arrived drugged and unconscious. Instructed to keep her that way due to extreme violent tendencies when not sedated. Moved to women's ward central seclusion for observation and treatment. Nurse Aubermill. And we have a new step. heck is in here? I don't know. But we got a new step. Find information about Aaron. Enter, enter the female ward. In that case, we should probably loot the men's ward first. That seems obvious. Yes, here is the men's ward. This cabinet started open, so we'll leave it that way. We have a pen, 10 of 106. Moira Asylum, men's ward. Here we go. Rope arrow. Interesting. And a shower vent report. 3 of 42, Chapter 5 documents. 116 NRY 842. Patient number 63 has been sneaking out of her seclusion and creating disturbances in the men's ward. The vent from the showers appears to be her point of egress and has been sealed with threaded screws. Observation will determine whether this measure was successful or not. Nurse Aubermill. 101 of 215 documents. A lot of noise in here. I feel like I'm making a lot of noise. Might be a better way to put it. Teacup, 11 of 106. <clears throat> Absence, 4 of 42, Chapter 5 documents. 2, 12, NRY 842. Huxley, I notice you've been absent quite frequently of late. I know the shifts in Reformation are difficult for you to bear, but we all must do our part to ensure the well-being of our most grievously ill patients. I have also noticed that lately you appear to be limping. Get Dr. Stedman to look you over. We need all our nurses in top shape while our patron is on the prowl. T. 
102 of 215 documents. An ink bottle, 12 of 106. Scissors, 13 of 106. What does this do? I do not like that sound. What the fuck was that? Attention, excitable patients. Great. And I'm going to guess that's the only way in there. We'll get opportunist points if it's not, but that's what replays are for. Alright, here we are in the first floor south wing. Another rope arrow. We must need ropes to fully explore this joint. Giving them out, <clears throat> giving them out like this. Where are asylum grounds? That's odd. We're not outside or anything. But looks like it keeps going down. But for now, we have a fork. 14 of 106, and another document. History 2, 812 NRY 689. The recent his 5 of 42, Chapter 5 documents. The history of Moira Asylum is a fascinating one, not accepting the recent debate over whether it is more prison or hospital. Ah, huh? it is her. The venerable widow Moira saw it as a place in which to treat the wounded of soul and heart, where one may recover from the world's ills to the soothing sounds of surf or silence. However, Baron Ulysses, in his infinite wisdom, originally saw in it a place where he could be rid of the city's degenerates, all for the price of a generosity unmatched in our current age. Did this used to be her house? 103 of 215. That would be especially creepy and awesome if we were back in her house. the ambiance is getting to me. A pocket portrait, 15 of 106. And a syringe, 16 of 106. Alright. for now. I didn't mean to get my bow out.
Mr. Rat. Alright, time to go through here to the secure section of the men's ward. Excitable patients. It's just wonderful, isn't it? Treatment Center. History 4. Six of forty-two, chapter five, documents. Yeah, that made me nervous. Ten eighteen, N R Y six eight nine. Let us not forget, however, that the care of the mentally ill comes with a price. We must pay it with our care, with our patience, and with our blood. For it is of our blood that these poor creatures come, and it is to us that they owe their peculiar sentiments. Take, for example, the master sneak thief so attributed to these times of woe. He is a man sorely tempted by that which to him does not belong, a misplacement of desire to see the world in an order which it must not deviate from. I wonder if that's the original Garrett. 104 of 215 documents. Anyway, and that syringe was 17 of 106 loot. Count. I am. Good. The Archivist, 7 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents, 517, NRY 842. Double locks have been placed on the Archivist's doors. Various supplies have been going missing. How he's getting out, I don't know, but I suspect the Watchman has been helping him. I have relocated the ladder from M10 to M2, so the two are no longer neighbors. That should quell their shenanigans for a while. Dr. Steadman. If you got hold of this key, send a thief to catch a thief. 105 of 215 documents. Room numbers, 8 of 42, chapter 5 documents. M1, patient number 16. M2, patient number 14. M3, empty. M4, patient number 49. M5 empty, M6 empty, M7 empty, M8 empty, M9 patient number 97, M10 empty, M11 empty, M12 patient number 31, M13 patient number 56, central seclusion empty. 106 of 215 documents. Alright. Ink bottle. 18 of 106. That scared me. Just that little chime, but gee. 
Jeez. Pocket portrait, 1906. Syringe, 20 of 106. I saw something glinting up here. Scissors, 21 of 106. Oh, look. Vent. Pocket portrait, 22 of 106. of 106. <laughs> Headaches, 9 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. Uh, 317 NRY 842. The headaches are getting worse. Some days I can barely see straight. I should be documenting my symptoms, but they come and go so rapidly at times that I'm not sure I felt them at all. All I can discern is that they seem to grow stronger the closer I am to Dr. Huntfield's patients, but that shouldn't even be possible. It could just be the mental strain of blocking out all the screaming. I swear he torments them on purpose when he knows it's my shift. I guess I should add paranoia to the list of symptoms. 107 of 215 documents. Ten, twenty-four of one hundred six. Let's get a checkpoint save. Just seems like a good idea. Report. Progress. 10 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. 912 NRY 841. Patient number 29 is showing remarkable progress following the removal of patient number 18 from the women's ward. He has become both tractable and agreeable. One could assume he is almost his normal self. Though I admit I am keen to see him in the treatment center for further study and analysis, his condition is not currently severe enough to warrant a transfer to reformation. However, if he were to resume his previous percussive demonstrations of anxiety, we must never forget that the bonds of mental illness are both invisible and insipid. He may require treatment yet. Dr. Huntfield. 108 of 215 documents. We've crossed the halfway mark towards the total. Ink bottle, 25 of 106. Okay, I did not fucking imagine that. What the hell just happened? Oh boy. Now I'll tell you this. I do not 
don't like it. What was hidden must be uncovered. No. Twenty-six of one hundred six. Oh look. <laughs> and a syringe. Twenty-seven of one hundred six. All right. This this shit is unnerving. I'm on board. I'm on board, everybody. Right, time to start searching the side rooms. I do happen to know there's a counter trigger in room M12, and we would do very well to save it for last, so let's start in M1. Death, one of those fucking bumps is gonna happen again. Those are scaring the shit out of me. Looks like there's anything in there, though. M11. Looks empty. There's central seclusion. Okay. M13. Oh, that's great. Empty. All right, now what do you suppose that is? M2. Great. Huh. 
I'll take this. The Repulsion of Civility, 10 of 12, the Court of Montanesi. Jagged red script covers the back of this canvas. It's hard to make a decision when the ties of life keep shuddering. Stay, go, stay, go. Arrows make the best letters. That's 58 of 84 collectibles, and I believe 2 of 6 inside this mission. Yes. Thirty-two of one of six. Loot. Well, we better look through the other people. A base. All right. Close this door behind me. M4. Base is 33 of 106. Here's M6. Don't see anything. This looks like some sort of elevator. Better steer clear of that, at least for now. There's central seclusion. Boarded up here as there. Here is M8. It seems to be empty. M12 is boarded up. The door is off its hinges. Here's M10. It's empty, but it has a route into M12. Before we hit that trigger, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a checkpoint save. And we've been playing a good 30 minutes now, so I'm going to make an anchor save and pause the recording for good measure. And we're back. Let's hit room M12. Spoon. 34 of 106. Spoon, 35 of 106. Fork, 36 of 106. Spoon, 37 of 106. Document. Cash. 11 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. I found a special cash today, left by someone like me. Little pieces of copper coin as old as the city and a strange painting. We think the same way, so there must be more. There's a noise in the walls sometimes, a clicking that sounds like my heartbeat. I have to have it. I will have it. Soon. That's 109 of 215 documents. Uh, let me just... How do I keep hitting objectives? Yeah, 37 of 106. Oh, there is another spoon. 38 of 106. And... This should get me to the female. Whoa. Look, look there. 38 of 106. Now we got someone standing there. Great. Pocket portrait 39 of 106. that noise. 
Night Warden on Duty, 1242 Chapter 5 Documents. No loitering in the halls, no noise-making in the rooms. Keep doors closed. Let's just get out of there. And maybe let's even close the door behind us for good measure. Yeah. Yeah, how do you like that? Alright. Security ward. Oh, security ward. Well, let's head into the women's ward. Moira Asylum. Breezeway. Ain't this grand. So, from what I read, the Night Warden is an invisible ghost that will murder the shit out of you if it catches you. It appears after you grab the key. You can only detect it by the sound, which is, you know, tough to do in this game. But, uh... Here we are in the women's ward. Security ward. locks. What's so important to him in an asylum? We got a fire arrow. And we got a pocket portrait. 40 of 106 loot. There's the keyhole. Ward key notice. 13 of 42 chapter 5 documents. 58 NRY 842. The women's ward key has been relocated to my desk in the men's ward. The dancer had been sneaking out to steal it and torment the linguist. If you need it, which you shouldn't, come and see me when I'm on duty. Dr. Stedman. 111 of 215 documents. Well, let's head inside. That door behind us just heads to the lobby. Well, let's see, we have a teacup. 41 of 106. Scissors, 42 of 106. Ink bottle, 43 of 106. And we can raise 
the security gate. Delightful. Hey, hey, hey! They put the good old looking glass basketball in this game. That's nice of them. Note that the candles are lit where they were not before. And there's a new document on the desk. Results. 14 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. 99NRY841. Dear Eliza, I know your opinion of me, but that doesn't discount the work I do here. Regardless of your personal qualms, I get results. The same can't be said for the coddling that happens up in the regular wards. How many patients have you cured in the last month, the last year? If your role as a doctor is too stressful for you, you might want to consider another profession. I hear the House of Blossoms is hiring Dr. Huntfield. Harsh. All right. 112 of 215 total documents. Now let's head back to the women's ward through the main door. kind of alerted us to the fact that, hey, 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 there are no stairs there. Let's have a look at this rope arrow anchor. Let's see what's down in here, shall we? secret room. Fully barricaded off from the rest of the asylum. History 1, 15 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. 810-NRY-689. It is through this lens of the author's experience that we shall explore this most mysterious of locales. The Moira Asylum, who some have called the trickster's playground, and yet which the educated know as a place of healing. It is the impression of the boy baron that this house of wellness could be a source of great creativity and income for the people which she serves. And that's 113 of 215 documents. And do some climbing where we find Pocket Portrait, 44 of 106. Now, what do we have here? And the Rose Brooch, 5 of 6, Flowers Eternal. Red roses declared true love or called for a mortal duel at dawn. It's 59 of 84 collectibles and 3 of 6 inside this mission. so we did need that rope arrow, that's good. We also needed to use those valves, so that's good too. So we're now on the first floor of the north wing. Scissors, 45 of 106.
This first floor entrance is also walled off, but we can use our key to get into the office. Voices. 16 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. The voices are getting louder. Every time I go near her, they start screaming. My hands are shaking so badly I can't even sign the register. What do I do? My hair, my fingernails, my teeth. It's like I'm falling apart. I can't go down there again. I can't keep doing this. Dr. Stedman will understand. I'll explain myself and get transferred back to the city. Everything will be all... 114 of 215 documents. That pen, I think, is 45? 46 of 106. And another document. Writing Materials, 17 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents. Policy on Writing Materials. 1. Writing materials may only be used under strict supervision. 2. Writing materials are to be provided only when the patient can express a distinct goal. 3. No pens with metal nibs are to be given to patients. 4. Self-expression is not a valid form of cognitive therapy. 115 of 215 Documents. And another pen, 47 of 106. Um, great. Ah, just a little rat. Alright, alright. All as well. Crying. Pocket portrait, 48 of 106. Looks like we found the showers. are turning on behind me. They all are. Alright, yeah, yeah, color me unnerved. get behind the bars in the security ward, which gets us that teapot, 49 of 106. base, 50 of 106.
she laughed as I started to approach her. Ah, mannequins, great. That patient is gone. Whoa! 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 Oh shit, that is fucking creepy. Ugh. Okay, okay, okay. That hand mirror was 51 of 106. And uh, I think... I think this note was not here before. Mess Hall Disturbance, 18 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents, 824 NRY 841. Dr. Stedman, Huntfield heard about the little dust-up you had in the dining hall the other night. He's gloating and strutting about, saying he'll soon have authority over patient number 18 due to your professional negligence. I wouldn't be surprised if he put number 79 up to it in the first place. Keep an eye on him. He's far too excited about getting his hands on a new test subject. H. 116 of 215 documents. Whoa. I don't think those bodies were there before. No. No, they weren't. The pools of blood are still around, though. Okay, yikes, yikes, yikes. We've got... A spoon, 52 of 106. We've got... of 106. The ball landed right at the poppy. I don't think they always did that. Huh. 53 of 106. We've got a spoon. 54 of 106. Teacup, 55 of 106. What did you see over here? Uh, a fork, 56 of 106. some food. Entertainment, 19 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents. 5-6, The Three Skit Review, 518, Lady's Choice, an Operetta in Five Parts. 6-3, Felicia's Harpsichord Honky Tonk. 621, Summer's Day Celebrations. 7-2, Dinner with Dr. Stedman. 117 of 215. Oh, fuck. What do you reckon this valve does? Just settle down. And let's 
let's head over here. Women's Ward. Moira Asylum, Women's Ward. Perhaps there are some kind of medical records that could tell me more. New step, find information about Aaron, search for asylum records. Well, I tell you what, this seems like a great time to make a new anchor save. That's what I'm going to do, and I'm going to pause the recording as well. And we're back! Let's get to it. Sure, Aaron was in central seclusion, but so we'll look everywhere else for now. Lessons 20 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents. Lessons for Mental Health 1. Repetition soothes the troubled mind. 2. A lack of excitement promotes healing. 3. Noise is the enemy of well being. 4. Obedience is the first sign of recovery. It's 118 of 215 documents. I take that noise to indicate that we're going to have to deal with the night warden some more. That's a fire. It's burning there in the corner. Great. Great. Scissors, 57 of 106, and a document. Report, patient number 18, 11, 21 of 42, chapter 5 documents, 11, 9, NRY 841. Patient number 18 is an extraordinary creature. When not sedated, she screams about thousands of voices and thrashes so violently that we had to triple her restraints. The main phrase she yells is for someone to wake up, but who she is talking to is unclear. I had patient number 22 brought into the treatment room several times in order to watch their interactions. He did not touch her, but became violent when removed from her presence. I can only hope Northcrest will allow me to attempt my new extraction technique soon. I had the device created specially for this task, and it would be a shame to let it rust simply because Elias can't handle a little blood. 119 of 215 documents. Yuck. Won't someone bring Edwina help wine? She's been waiting so long. Ah, uh, Edwina Moira. She wants the glass of wine. Oh, hell no! Oh, I ain't down with that. Looks like, uh, that golem we saw back in, uh... Back in Chapter 3. Treatment Center is barricaded still. your standard door. Can't see anything down in the courtyard, but... Yeah, alright. Oh, fucking hell, what is that? into central seclusion. So let's have a look there. We got a pop 
speed and we got the fucking blinking eyes in the keyholes. Boy. Looks like we can get into central seclusion. Here. It's too dangerous! Yeah, that wasn't unnerving or anything. We got a poppy. We got a pocket portrait. 58 of 106, I think. Yes. open door that wasn't open before. There's room W13, W11. This has a document. Heat and cold treatment. 22 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. Melancholia is the symptom most reported by today's caregivers, for which there is a remedy both simple and effective. It requires the application of extreme heat to those areas of the body which may, to the touch, have the feel of clamminess or wetness. As for the drier areas of the skin, where one may find a vigorousness unbecoming of mortal flesh, the repeated submersion of the patient into a vessel containing water no colder than an eighth of a degree above freezing shall draw from that body part the very obstinacy that so afflicts its owner. Well, they lifted the heat therapy straight out of the cradle, but the cold therapy is their contribution. 120 of 215 documents. You know, I always brought the lid on my record line. W9. We have a fork, 59 of 106. Chill coming tonight. Such a sea of change coming tonight. Whoa. Okay, okay, okay. We're good. Alright. That's 60 of 106. That syringe. supposed to be able to go in there. Those scissors are 61 of 106. Here we are in W5. We'll climb all 
these stacks and hop into the office through this window. Aggression again, 23 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. 427, NRY 842. All patients have been exhibiting increased aggression of late. We had similar incidents last year when patient number 18 was in the central seclusion, but those ceased with her removal to reformation. Still, the behaviors occurring now show disturbing similarities. Patient number 82 actually growled at me when I brought her meal this morning. A child should not be able to make those noises. All we can do is continue to provide the care that they need. I will not be responsible for sending any more patients to Huntfield's abattoir, Nurse Albert Mill. 121 of 215 documents. Right, we've got... here. Patient Notes, 24 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents, 38 NRY 842. Patient number 79 has been experiencing increased delusions of demons in the corners. Recommend cognitive therapy with Dr. Stedman to calm her. 312 NRY 842. Patient was found to have drilled holes in his walls again, moved to 7M and cautioned. Recommend no forks or knives during mealtimes to avoid reoccurrence. 318 NRY 842. Patient number 49 moved from 3M to 4M. Inconsistency of noise was disturbing patient number 16 and causing him to scream at varied intervals. 322 NRY 842. Patient number 78 continues to insist that her presence is accidental and that she is sane. Recommend lobotomization if her delusions continue. Patient number 45 is evidence that the procedure is a massive success. 324 NRY 842. Dr. Huntfield continues in the delusion that he should have jurisdiction over the entire asyl asylum. Recommend he pull his head out of his arse and stop suggesting lobotomizations in the office logbook when I'm off duty. 122 of 215 documents. Third. I could have told them you were trouble. Patient transfer. 25 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. 93NRY841. It pains me to confirm your inquiry, but in fact, patient number 18 will undergo procedure in room 3F as you fear. I thought we'd closed the door on that room of horrors years ago. The subject is classified for selective experimentation on the instruction of Baron Northcrest himself. This is the last time I sign a patient over to the treatment center. They need doctors, not butchers. Huntfield will be taking over this subject in all aspects. I pity the girl, Thurlow. May she find peace somewhere in her madness, Nurse Auberville. 123 of 215 documents. But what did you do? Show me. New objective, move to the treatment center wing. We've got a teapot, I think that's 62 of 106, yes. Pen, 63 of 106. An ink bottle, 64 of 106. something in the shelves back here. Scissors, 65 of 106. Look at my other stats, too. All good so far. All right. Hiding over behind the bed. 
Reporter's Notes, 26 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents. Patient number 14, the watchman, caught peeking into windows and following strangers, treated with solitary confinement. Patient number 53, the baker, admitted for having hot skin, undergoing hydrotherapy. Patient number 63, the dancer, murderer who torments patient number 79, shamelessly promiscuous, regular sessions with Huntfield, treatment unknown. Patient number 31, the archivist, uncontrollable urge to steal, occasional electrotherapy. Patient number 22, father, the duke, considered very dangerous, related to the patron, the biggest secret after number 18, find out more. It's 124 of 215 documents. That's a new effect. The poppies usually just disappear. We got a poppy and we got a document. History 3. 27 of 42 Chapter 5 Documents, 825 NRY 689. And yet Moira Asylum is not without its share of troubles. Battered by the constant to and fro of coastal winds, it has a melancholy and beleaguered atmosphere not common to the more grounded buildings of the city, nor does it want for draughts and other embellishments. Her staff are both courteous and cheerful, despite their conditions, for which they are to be commended. Most startling yet, however, is the fertile soil of the Asylum's island, within which have been sown the many seeds of wildflowers no longer common to the more civilized surrounds to which we have become accustomed. 125 of 215 documents. Six of one hundred six. Room W six. Sixty-seven of one hundred six. The view ten has a hand mirror. Sixty-eight of one hundred six. document. 
Huntfield's Illness, 28 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents, 314 NRY 842. Thurlow, Dr. Huntfield seems to have come down with a disfiguring ailment of the back. He has trouble standing upright and performing his operations. He asked me to examine him, but I'm afraid I could find nothing wrong. Of course, he then called me a failure and stomped away, so I neglected to mention that the back of his head is now entirely bald, or that his left leg is beginning to twist as he walks. I may suggest he try his own electrotherapy techniques. I'm sure his patients would be more than happy to apply the treatment on his behalf. E. 126 of 215 documents. So it's being suggested that people in here slowly turned into monsters. That's comforting. Alright, time to head to the treatment center. Everything behind us, I believe, to be clear. New objective, descend to the treatment level. Treatment center, main building. Alright, we got those skeleton skull pictures again. This is a good time for an anchor save and to pause the recording. Alright, we are back. Let's go check out the treatment center. gonna regret it, but... Confidentiality, 29 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. Passing beyond this point constitutes a strict confidentiality agreement. Experimental techniques remain the property of their respective owners. Anyone found copying the use of these techniques is liable for treason under the Medical Act of NRY 839. 127 of 215 documents. I have to say, the Widow Moira was kind of creepy when she was alive in Thief 3. Her ghost is scaring the shit out of me. Oh look, a syringe. 69 of 106. I wonder if the monsters have anything to do with what killed her husband and infested the abysmal gale back in Thief 3. That was... that plot thread was never resolved. That could be good. Oh boy, here we go. First floor. Seventy of one hundred six. That raised to that gate. I wonder if it raised any others. Yes, it raised that one too.
second floor security ward. Great. Attention, excitable patients. Treatment center, third floor. Restricted access, authorized medical personnel only. We got switches. Magnifying glass. 71 of 106. Surgical scissors, 72 and 73 of 106. Treatment center, third floor. New objective, find room 3F. Medical experimentation in progress. B electrotherapy chamber. All dead. All dead but the shadows. They were taken by the shadows. The shadows have been hungry since she went away. Hydrotherapy chamber. I think there's no power, so none of these switches will do anything. They're hurting me. There's too much pain. Three D lobotomy room. Great. Well, it's obvious they put the most effort in level, at least of all the ones I've been in so far. That looks like an oil slick. 3E operating room. And 3F experimental treatment. Doors need power. There's probably a generator down here somewhere. 
New objective, access room 3F. Find and start the power generator. Alright, well now they're just totally ripping off the cradle. They're gonna turn on the power and all hell's gonna break loose. But, that's alright, they're doing a good job of it anyway. We've got flammable shit. Let's see. We got food. We got a throwable. I thought I already had one, but that's okay. Book. Escape note. 30 of 42 chapter 5 documents. Avery, leave quietly. Ignore the oil and glass. They're for your protection. Light a torch and meet me at the docks. I don't know what they are, but if one of them sees you, set the bastard alight and run. I'll wait for you. T. 128 of 215 documents. Let's get in drawers. Lockdown override. Caution. Respect emergency procedures. Flash bombs. Yeah, they're... They're arming us up for something that's not human. It's about damn time, but... Elevator lock. 31 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. 1214 NRY 841. Pete, I have a favor to ask of you. The elevator to Reformation is currently open access. Anyone can just waltz in and pay a visit to maximum security. I'd like you to install a locking mechanism. This isn't just for the safety of those in Reformation, but for the safety of our patients here in the asylum as well. What happens if one of Huntfield's subjects gets loose? The patients on the upper levels would be defenseless. Think about it. I'll get you whatever clearance you need. Eliza. 129 of 215 documents. This joker's got a trap on it. You can disable that up here. Let's get her open. Microscope, 74 of 106, and a book. Extracting the Primal, 1 of 13, Baron Northcrest documents. 622 NRY 841. The ritual to harness the Primal suffered a terrible setback, but perhaps there is still hope. The energy merely entered a weaker vessel than the one intended. I cannot see how this was possible, but there must be a way to return it to the stone. 130 of 215 documents. Hooray. Alright. Three G sensory deprivation chamber. Sensory deprivation. Thirty two of forty two chapter five documents. Doors are to remain closed at all times while room is occupied. Removal from the cares of the world is soothing for the soul. Generator room. Oh, hooray. Let's see, we got food. We got a syringe, 75 of 106.
great. Time to turn on the generator. Shit's gonna go down. Let's go ahead and make a new anchor save here. And even though that was a short segment, let's go ahead and pause the video too. Yeah. Alright, here goes. Let's fire up the generator. Step. Access room 3F. Find a way into the room. Great, suddenly there's light. Oh, that gate is closed. Awesome. Oh, sure. Let's override the lockdown. Yeah, let's do that. Let's open all the doors. What choice do we have? Lights are on. Doors are open. Except 3F. Check my suspicion count right quick. Everything's still good. We can get into the sensory deprivation chamber now. Magnifying glass, 76 of 106. Get into room 3F. Oh boy. First up, we've got a note. Calibration, 33 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. Calibrate machine carefully before commencing operation. Piercing the veil that masks the window to the soul can reveal the path to wellness. Oh boy. Transfer request. 34 of 42 Chapter 5 documents. 79NRY841. I understand the inevitable concern, but I am forced to arrange for patient number 18 to be transferred below to the prison level. I'm well aware that this is not standard procedure, but the subject must be isolated for everyone's safety. The prison level is the only suitable space. Dr. Stedman. 133 of 215 documents. And, well, let's just go ahead and grab whatever that is. Syringe, huh? 77 of 106. Don't show him you're scared. Don't let him see you lose control. I wanted to stop him. I wanted to save myself, but they won't let me wake up. I need the primal out of the girl now, but do not let her die, no matter the cost. You understand the fear, don't you, Garrett? The fear of being trapped, of being used. Quickly! She's corrupting it! See? Oh. I ruin everything. The primal is dangerous! It must be controlled! No! It's no good. I'll take her back down to the prison level. I thought you died. But it was worse. You did steal the primal that night. Now the Baron wants it back. He spoke about the prison level. Looks like I'm going even deeper into this hole. New objective. Descend to the asylum's lowest level. Oh, looks like we... Looks like we finally got bad guys.
surgical scissors, 78 of 106. Syringe, 79 of 106. Looks like this guy actually has a pickpocket on his face. I need to make sure I didn't raise any suspicions just then. Knocking in pipes, 35 of 42, Chapter 5 documents. Pete, fix the knocking in these those rotting pipes. I swear the accursed noise is making its way into my dreams. I've even caught myself tapping it with my fingers as I work. I ask you, is that any way to operate, Dr. Huntfield? 134 of 215 documents. I hear the damn tapping, too. He's just human. Alright. Got another note. Sterilization, 36 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. Clean instruments with alcohol before commencing vivisection. Exploration of stresses on the human body is best done in the heady light of life. way over here, too. A magnifying glass, 80 of 106. There's a safe on the wall over there. The combination is 731. You can gather it by listening to the knocking in the pipes, actually. We have. Good find. An ivory circle, five of seven Serendi stone circles. A gilded band mounted with a cluster of ivory. That's 60 of 84 collectibles and four of six for this mission. Watch seal, 81 of eight of 106. Microscope, 80. Too slow. The microscope is 82 of 106. And that blast arrow is just its own thing. Oh, seven, three, one. Let's allow the patient to patrol in and out again. You had to listen carefully the first time. It looks like if you quick load, the knocking stops. Let's 
So when this is done, we'll be at 82 of 106, and 4 of 6 collectibles inside the mission. Let's do this. Let's try and grab a ring last this time, so we can just swoop away. 81 of 106, 82 of 106. Now, what do we... Ivory Circle. 5 of 7, 60 of 84. Four of six. All right. Very good. All right, here's room 3D. We've got surgical scissors, 83 of 106. We've got a flash bomb. Be careful there. That syringe will be 84 of 106. I don't think he enters this room. I think he just stares in from the door. Yes, that syringe makes 84 of 106. Lobotomy Room, 37 of 42 Chapter 5 Documents. Adjust gauge of orbitoclast to account for patient skull thickness. An overactive imagination is the first sign of madness. See the hydrotherapy room. Like butterflies on the bracken in summer. What I don't know is how I'm gonna get the magnifying glass there on top. Flies on the bracket. So we can't get up over here. I'm positive if I try to get it from next to the guy. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. How the hell are we supposed to get that? Like butterflies on the bracken in summer. You can't even get that note. New goal is to send to the asylum's lowest level. That was on. Found you. <laughs> we can't turn off that light. This is a different guy than the butterflies on the bracken in summer. I 
it, seriously. Butterflies on the bracken in summer. How much loot am I currently sitting on? 84 of 106. Get into room 3B. I think we can if we just swoop past the guy tending the fire there. He changed down there. He changed in the dark. He to stop the shadows from spreading. Butterflies on the bracket. I do not see a way to get that. This guy's not going to move. I especially don't see a way to get that note. Except to use a fucking distraction. Butterfly. Hey. Shit. Well, give me a moment. All right. Well, it's claimed that there's on the bracket in summer. no good way to get the document, but I won't accept that. Breathe out water. Breathe in air. You feel released. Did I see something? Well, that was close. I think if I move that a little faster, I can probably do it without the suspicion, even. I just need to time it right. Right when he decides to push the button. Butterflies on the bracken in summer. What? Alright, well, except I need the damn animation to go a little faster, so I don't think I can actually be in peak mode. Did I see someone? Nope. You sure didn't. Figure out his timing, I think. Hey. Well, and maybe, just maybe, I should try to come from the other shadow instead of around the wall. Hey. Damn. 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 Come on. It's just the animation is so long. Why can't we just get it instantaneously, or from the shadow? Hey. Okay. Wait, I can... I can push E. Yeah, I can... I can get in range right here. Go as soon as his head turns. Oh, god damn it. This is killing me. I have to get this document. This is the only thing no one else figured out, but... What? Someone moving about. Hey! Oh, that was close. That was close. But, it did not work. Let's 
swooping doesn't work. I had better luck coming from over here. No question about that. Butterflies on the bracken in summer. Breathe out water. Breathe in air. You feel released. What are you about? Huh? There! Hi. There has to be a way to do this. There just has to. Butterflies on the bracket. This is killing me, though. Like, seriously, this is just unacceptable. Hey! Why do they set it up that way? Butterflies on the bracken in summer. Hey! Oh, that was close, that was close. But I can't have the suspicion raised, I just can't. Butterflies on the bracket somewhere. Don't want any opportunist points. Which the suspicion would give me. So Unfortunately, Garrett will stubbornly water. insist in air. on going you feel released. front and center to read the damn Stop. thing. Hey. I think I went too soon. There's just there's got to be a, some way to time this right. Sneaking around. Hey! There! I. <sighs> hey! Moving about. Well, I feel a bit foolish. Oh, boy. Getting closer, I know that. I just need to. I'm convinced this will work if I just get the timing exactly right. I have no other options, so. What? I went too soon, I think. Yeah, as is. As he's growing a little bit more and a little bit more suspicious. Hey! I need that to culminate in him turning away to hit the switch. It should just give me the time I need to swoop. Go. Yeah, bitch! Alright! Hydrotherapy, 38 of 42, Chapter 5 Documents. Remember to vary length of submersion for maximum effectiveness. Breathe in water, breathe out light. It's 137 of 215 documents, and I'm very happy to say the rest is quite doable. That's 85 of 106 loot. Now we can get that magnifying glass from over here. Like I kind of suspected we'd be able to. 86 of 106. Loot. Awesome. Let's head into B2 now. They changed down there. They changed in the dark. 
need to stop the shadows from spreading. 87 of 106, that microscope. I'm hopeful I can get this document with this trouble. Spreading like that. Of course I can't. Great. Shock therapy. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Now he doesn't. All dead. All dead but the shadows. They were taken by the shadows. The shadows. Hey. Do this. I don't fucking know. It changed. Oh, for fuck's sake! Why? Why do they put stuff in places like that where you can't fucking get to it inside their systems? It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Eighty-eight of one hundred six. Alright, maybe a swoop in, swoop out will work. No. That was actually much worse. Much worse. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. All dead. Fuck. There! I see him! 88 of 106, and we gotta get that like document. Spreading like oil. I wonder if I can do it in down there from in here. In the dark. Need to stop the shadows from space. Okay, well, standing up was a bad idea. Spreading work. like oil. All dead. All dead, but the shadows, they were taken by- God damn it! Oh, this shit bothers me. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Spreading! Hey. Why? Can't we just skip the animation and let me collect the document? I don't change down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Hey. I was gonna say this Found guy. You scum! This guy's got no variation in his movements. Maybe I can get it from It changed down the there. Door. It changed know. in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. certainly make things easier, but I highly doubt it'll work that way. Hey, no one's sneaking around. Yeah, no, I gotta come from in here. So... Huh. Now let's try swooping in. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Spreading like oil. Hey. I'm moving faster towards it. It gets me farther away, not closer. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Well, there's a little variance in his shadow. All dead. All dead, but the shadows, they were taken by the shadows. The shadows have been hungry since she went away. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Hey. The, the animation just pulls us into his field of view. And he doesn't. It changed down there. Move. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. How do we get that document? I don't know. Spreading like oil. 
Hey. Found you! I don't understand how I can possibly get it. The only guy who's Spreading like oil. ghosted the whole game so far, you know, he just skips the documents. He thinks oh, they don't damn. matter. All he cares about is the loot. So, fucking hell. Alright. Give me some... Spreading like oil. Well, let's get inside a shadow. Let me make a new anchor save. And pause the recording and do some experimenting. As usual, in these situations, it's become apparent to me that IDOS wants to force me Spreading like oil. to do it their way, which is to take a suspicion and fuck up my statistics oh, for the sake okay. of their story. The they were taken because by watch the what shadows. happens. I think I heard something. Now he's not even the one who heard, who's saying he thinks he heard something, I don't think. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Hey, what's going on? Maybe there's a maybe there is a way to do this without getting a suspicion. What was that noise? No, it is him. He's just... He's never going to be happy about this fight. What's going on? But now watch this. This is why I'm pretty sure they're forcing us to do it, because we're going to have a little uh, narrative moment in a second here. Once his suspicion wears off. Times. No, no, no! My light, come back, come back! And see, and that's it. Strange to me is how they keep switching to their normal voices. Spreading like oil. I need to beat their system. They changed down there. They changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from. Sp Why couldn't they have just? They could have made their point by. Having the note over there, it changed down so there. I could get to it. it changed moving in the dark. fast, need to stop the shadow. Hey. Or if I could just get it the second I get to it, instead of, or if Garrett could rip it off the wall and take it with him. Changed down there. Hey. Instead of having to wait so damn long. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Hey. For whatever reason, I got closer that time. It changed down there. It changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Hey. It changed down there. Hey. I feel like I made it about an inch farther that time. I'm not quite ready to give in and take a suspicion hey. yet. Well, of course, that time I still got nailed and I didn't even get the document to boot. He changed the... Hey. They could have just rotated him five degrees. And this wouldn't have been an issue. Found! It changed down. Hey. Found! I can't even get to a spot where I can look at it. You know, where I can have it in interaction range. It changed. Found! 
don't just. It's really silly that they have different voices, but then they switch to standard guard voices when they're alerted. He changed down there. He changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from. Well, we can't bump him. He changed down there. He changed in the dark. Hey, I feel like that was even a little closer than other attempts. He changed down there. He changed in the dark. Need to stop the shot. Hey. I kind of feel like the closer I am to his back, the, the more time I have. Spreading like oil. Found. Well, yes, I bought myself about an ounce of extra time. Not enough. He changed down there. He changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Well, it doesn't get much closer than this. All dead. All dead, but the shadows, they were taken by the shadows. The shadows have been hungry since she went away. Hey. Well, that time it didn't work. There's, I feel like there's got to be some he changed approach down there. angle hey. that's going to work. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe Idos really is just going to force me to use a water arrow. Spreading like oil. Force me to raise a suspicion. Force me to get Found an opportunist you. point. Or miss a document. Spreading like oil. They have to know how shitty that would be. All dead. Hey. Alright, swooping forward gives me less time. Presumably because the fast movement is changed down there. They changed in the dark. Need to stop the shadows from spreading. Think traps. Spreading like oil. All dead. All dead, but the shadows, they were taken by the shadows. Found! Why does he have to get so fucking close? Standing isn't helping. Even though I'm able to move faster that way. He changed down there. He changed in the dark. Need to stop the shot was hey. Alright, more experimenting. I'm not yet resigned to accepting down there. suspicion. Alright. No one else has managed to do it. Spreading like oil. I can't figure out any possible other angle to try All dead. because All he dead. literally the shadows, does not move taken he by the never shadow. turns his head the shadows unlike the other hungry. guys so since she went on somebody do that we're gonna have to do this we're gonna have to eat the suspicion and the opportunist points i'd rather do that than miss the document shock therapy disregard patient distress when completing shock therapy course a moment of pain can bestow a lifetime of well-being. Alright, 138 of 215 documents. With that, let's head back into here. Wait for him to raise it, and then we'll go through that vent. Fucking hell, Idos. Make me so mad with their horse shit. But what can you do? Not much is the answer. that we 
got a blast arrow here. That's handy. Let's head through this vent now. We have a note. Treasure. I made it. I found it. The other man, the other me, he hid his caches in these vents like a well-worn coat. The close walls are comforting in a way I have never felt before, and I feel so close to him that I can almost smell his scent. The treasure of his labors can't be far, and the clicking, beating heart of our combined desire must be closer yet. A small rest and I will continue. I have come so close it can only be a matter of feet before the years join us in triumph. That's 139 of 215 documents. We have a bracelet, 89 of 106, and a pocket portrait, 90 of 106. Very cool. Prison stairwell. This isn't going to be good. Treatment center. things again, those golems. Got a magnifying glass, 91 of 102. Got Crayman noises, that's always fun. Ancient Ingot, 92 of 106, a poppy, and a box with surgical scissors, 93 of 106. Shit, look, there's one of those things. Let's have a good look at it. They don't like light. How's that gonna interact? Oh. Do I hide in the light now? That's going to be crazy, but awesome. Well, there's one of them. Oh look, another free focus point. Old keeper magic.
We have another ancient ingot on the ground, 94 of 106. Access, restricted access. Reformation area for criminally insane. Prison rules. 41 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. Do not approach patients. Do not speak to patients. Disregard all claims of sanity. Patients are restrained for their own protection. Forty of 215 documents. Was Aaron really held down here? I should check all the cells. New objective, locate Aaron's holding cell. No one saw one of those damn things down here. Just a little bit ago. Report. Aggression. 42 of 42, Chapter 5, Documents. 1015 NRY 841. I have noticed that patient number 11 exhibits increased aggression and agitation when patient number 18 is being wheeled past his room. His attempts to touch her never get far, but his struggles are violent enough that today he pulled one of the anchor hooks from the ceiling of his cell. This will require further study. Dr. Huntfield. Very interesting. How am I doing? 94 of 106. Syringe, 95 of 106. Syringe, 96 of 106. Food, but I can't carry any more. I've seen my share of prisons in the city. Nothing like this. Starting to hear noises. things around. I think I hear them too. Yep, there's one. Syringe, 97 of 106. How do they work? Very careful to be absolutely silent.
There's something on the shelf up here. It's just food. me the hell out, though. secret area. Now, what do we have here? Mechanical eye. Encased in a patina of rust, tiny gear works and lenses form an eye-shaped machine. I guess the sneak thief is the old Garrett, and we just found his eye. Ah, alright. Six of nine unique loot. Sixty-one of eighty-four collectibles, and I think five of six inside this mission. Yes, good. Scissors, 99 of 106. Apologies about the game crashing just then. At least I didn't lose my videos or anything. Oh shit, there's one coming this way. Can't make any noise. And word is, and this is kind of fun, if you do make any noise, they actually use focus to find you. That's how they deal with their lack of eyesight. Very careful, not to knock over any of these faces or anything. I can hear the damn things everywhere. Yeah, we need that, but we can't knock that over in grabbing it, so 
That urn is 100 of 106. Here's a terrible thing. I'll take this. Maybe not so terrible. Child's memory. Four of six memories of the dead. Edith, I'll treasure you in my heart forever. 62 of 84 collectibles. I think 6 of 6 for this mission. And one suspicion raised. Had to put out that damn light switch. I hope he turns around before he gets to me or I'll be in serious trouble. Shit, look at it using focus. Well, let's avoid breaking that face in the first place. What about that? I think that's a superior strategy here, anyway. Syringe, 101 of 106. Syringe, 102 of 106. And the magnifying glass, 103 of 106. over here past these two. We cannot 
move that close to them. Not that fast, anyway. Yeah, it's not a proximity trigger, it's just that... even super slow movement that close to him is enough to set him off. How interesting. Surgical scissors, 104 of 106. Fire arrows. Fire arrow. Swoop through there. Not directly anyway. Let's just stay nice and slow. Because there is another piece of loot over here. Right by that one. Let's go back this way. Yeah, we gotta get that syringe and these guys. So, let's do our creeping and make our way through. One oh six of one oh six. Completed, undetected so far. 
Just need to hope my force opportunist points don't add up to an opportunist rating on the mission. nearly be done since we found everything. Maximum security. Oh boy. Poppies arrive on silver trays, and I'm falling into darkness. Why am I alone? Every time I breathe, it hurts. I want to stop the voices. Another copy there. It would have been better to die. Another copy. How can I breathe when there's death everywhere? It's like statues of patients turning into those things. with the prisoners.
please be quiet. Looks like we finally found Aaron's holding cell. Of course he hates me. No! Why can't we hate him? Keep her away from the fighting! She's too important to die in this rock! Too important to be allowed to die. I wonder if they understand the pain. She is our future! The Northcrest bastards stole me away. Are you with me, Garrett? Someone's gonna die. Maybe I am going crazy. Only one way to find out. The Baron. Back to Northcrest Manor. Back to where it all began. It says new objective, find a way into Aaron's cell. We're inside the asylum entrance. Completed. Still got ghost, but damn if we didn't almost get opportunist. Jesus. So, all right, six of six collectibles, 106 of 106 loot. I'm gonna take it, cause I have no idea how to avoid putting out that fire when you tried to get that little document. So, there we go. Continue. Collection display updated. The following night. And of course, we got a new document. 142 of 215. 5 of 8 chapter recaps. Aaron's alive. Somehow that doesn't make me feel any better. She's spending more time in my head than I do. Seems the primal energy's inside her and she's corrupted it somehow. That damage is still there, seeping out through the walls of Moira because of Northcrest's experiments. Is that why he took her away? There's only one man with the answers I need right now, the Baron. And that is that. We are finished. If the Baron has Aaron, then I need to break into Northcrest Manor before the mob does. It's time I got some answers. New objective, get to Northcrest Manor in Aldale. Sounds like we're going to have a new uh, city district to explore. Before we do that, let's make new sa anchor saves with Chapter 5 completed. And, I will say, that's it for this installment of Let's Play Thief. We completed Chapter 5, The Forsaken, with one suspicion raised, unfortunately. It seems to me that it was the, definitely the only way to get that document. Again, if anyone wants to disabuse me of that notion, please uh, inform me. I'll be happy to replay it and fix my stats. Anyway, next time we will tackle... The City Part 5. Until then, thank you very much for watching, and have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.